going out of the Gulf of Mexico and a potential tropical storm brewing there. You can see it on your screen, threatening the coasts of Texas and Louisiana, which have already had a lot of rain lately. Meteorologist Jim Cantori with our partners at the Weather Channel is watching it for us. Jim, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Tony. Sometimes it's those pre-existing conditions that put us over the edge here. As we would expect at the peak of the tropical season, we are active across the basin. But PTC-6, which is, by the way, our fourth PTC of the season, will soon become Francine as it works its way over these warm waters. A lot of deep convection this morning, a lot of showers and thunderstorms, but really no consolidated center. It has to come north and then northeast because that's the way it's going to be steered around the high pressure. It will be a hurricane at landfall. The track this morning has shifted a little bit farther to the east, right over Acadiana. This is for Wednesday and Wednesday night, probably in the Category 1, maybe Category 2 range. And like you said, Tony, because of the rain that we've had, you add 5 to 10 inches on top of that. Now you've got a big flood threat in through here in addition to a storm surge threat. Tony, expect watches in the form of hurricane this afternoon as well as storm surge watches coming up. Back to you. We will keep watching it. Jim Cantore, thank you.